Ons Jabour stands as a professional tennis player from Tunisia who boasts a career best ranking of world number two according to the Women's Tennis Association, a pinnacle she reached on June 27, 2022. Currently holding the title of Tunisia's number one player in tennis, Jabour is not only the highest ranked African, but also the top ranking Arab tennis player in the history of WTA and ATP rankings. Her achievements include securing five singles titles on the WTA Tour, along with an impressive tally of 11 singles titles and one doubles title on the ITF circuit. Jabur achieved the runner-up position at Wimbledon in both 2022 and 2023, as well as at the US Open in 2022, marking a historic milestone as the inaugural African and Arab woman to compete in a major singles final. Ones Jabur, born on the 28th of August 1994 in Ksar Halal, a small town in Tunisia, was introduced to tennis by her mother Samira at the age of three. Jabur embarked on her tennis journey under the guidance of coach Nabil Malika, a partnership that spanned for almost 10 years from when she was four years of age to 13. Their collaboration began at a tennis promotion centre at her school, where the absence of dedicated tennis courts led her to train at nearby hotels. Her professional journey began in her teenage years, where she reached two junior major girls singles finals at the French Open in 2010 and 2011. She secured victory in the French Open 2010, becoming the first Arab woman to clinch a junior major title since 1964. Transitioning from a decade of predominantly competing at the ITF level, Jabir increased her presence on the WTA Tour starting in 2017. Recognizing her outstanding contributions, she was honored with the Arab Woman of the Year Award in 2019. The 2020 Australian Open witnessed Jabur's groundbreaking performance, making her the initial Arab woman to reach a major quarterfinal, a remarkable feat she replicated at the 2021 Wimbledon Championships. Further enhancing her legacy, she became the first Arab woman to secure a WTA Tour title at the 2021 Birmingham Classic. Notably, Jabur's accomplishments soared when she clinched the 2022 Madrid Open, a prestigious WTA 1000 event marking her most significant title to date. This victory not only solidified her position as a prominent figure in women's tennis, but also established her as the first female Tunisian and Arab player to triumph at this elite level. In February 2018, Jabur transitioned to working with coach Bertrand Perret. Under Perret's guidance, Jabur found a coach who not only supported her style of play, but also aimed to enhance her strengths rather than alter her approach. Expressing her satisfaction, she stated, and I quote, I think he understands my game. He tries to improve my good shots, not change what I do. Of late, Jabur is coached by Issam Jalali, a former Tunisian Davis Cup player. In November 2015, Jabur married Karim Kamoun, a Russian Tunisian. Karim is a fitness coach with a master's degree in sports science and deeply passionate about fitness training. He has stood steadfastly by Jabir's side, not only as her life partner, but also as her tennis trainer. Karim was a professional fencer from 2003 to 2011, after which he transitioned into a fencing coach in Qatar. However, around 2017, he chose to leave his coaching role to fully accompany his wife on the tennis tour. Karim remains unwavering in his dedication to helping Jabur realize her dreams. In the early stages of Jabir's career, her husband even went to the extent of sending her his earnings to cover the costs of flights to her tennis tournaments. Karim's support for Jabir extends from the tennis court to the kitchen. Karim showcases his cooking skills in the relationship, 
Being the superior cook, he most of the time prepares meal for the family. Revealed that his specialty is frutti di mare spaghetti, seafood spaghetti, and he is very good at preparing this dish. As of November 2023, Jabur estimated net worth stands at $10 million. According to WTA website, she has accumulated over $11.5 million in prize money to date. Together with her husband, they have a net worth estimated at $15 million. In addition to her tennis pursuits, Jabur also generates income from her collaborations with Haval, Qatar Airways, Evolve, and Tunisi Telecom. Jabur has a passion for luxurious automobiles, boasting an extensive collection that includes a Great Wall Haval M4, Haval Jolion 1.5T, and Great Wall Haval H6. On August 25, 2023, Jabur acquired a minority interest in the North Carolina Courage, a national women's soccer league club, becoming the second professional tennis player to engage in such ownership alongside Naomi Osaka. Jabuer generously donated her tennis rackets through an auction, successfully raising $27,000 to benefit a hospital in Tunisia. In 2022, Jabur received the Peace Champion of the Year Award from Peace and Sport, a charitable organization located in Monaco. Jabur showcased in the tennis documentary series Breakpoint, which made its debut on Netflix on January 13, 2023. Ons Jabur presently possesses an opulent residence in Sousse, Tunisia, her hometown where she resides with her family and her husband, Karim Kamoun. Jabur's choice of shots and her skill in executing them led observers during her junior days to dub her Roger Federer, drawing parallels with the Swiss superstar's remarkable ability to focus on playing the ball rather than the opponent. While she now dismisses the comparison, Jabur remains a staunch admirer of the 20-time Grand Slam champion. Beyond her excellence in tennis, the Tunisian athlete is football fan, her other favoured sport. She avidly supports Etoile Sportive du Sahel, a football team based in Sousse, her hometown, and the Spanish football powerhouse, Real Madrid, and she is a big fan of Cristiano Ronaldo. Thank you for watching our Sports Star Stories. Subscribe to our channel and stay updated for more interesting videos and captivating stories of our stars in the world of sports.